Welcome to Machiavellian Psychology, where we delve into the depths of power strategy and human nature. Today, we explore a pivotal lesson from Niccolo Machiavelli's seminal work, The Prince, The Stability of the State or Office. Niccolo Machiavelli, a name synonymous with cunning and strategic thinking. In his book The Prince, written in the 16th century, Machiavelli presents a guide for rulers on how to maintain power and control. Machiavelli's central thesis revolves around the stability of the state. He argues that the security and strength of the state are paramount, even above moral or ethical considerations. In today's terms, think of it as the stability of an office or organization. The principles remain strikingly relevant. Machiavelli posits that a ruler or a leader must be pragmatic and often ruthless. The end, which is the stability and prosperity of the state, justifies the means. He suggests that instability breeds chaos, which is detrimental to any state or organization. A stable ruler, therefore, must sometimes make harsh, unpopular decisions for the greater good. Machiavelli also emphasizes adaptability and realism. A successful leader understands the landscape, be it a battlefield or a market, and adapts accordingly. One of the most controversial aspects of Machiavelli's philosophy is his view on morality. He argues that a leader should not be bound by traditional moral values if they stand in the way of the state's needs. This Machiavellian approach raises important questions about ethics and leadership. How far should one go in the pursuit of stability? Where do we draw the line? From ancient rulers to contemporary CEOs, the quest for stability remains a central theme in the exercise of power. Thank you for watching Machiavellian Psychology. Remember to like, share, and subscribe for more insights into the minds of history's greatest strategists. Until next time, keep pondering the Machiavellian mysteries of power and leadership.